it does make business sense. Uh, it does make financial sense. It does help the environment. It does have the potential to help the housing crisis. It can do all these things if you, if you accept it and lean into it. The things that made a house energy efficient were the things that also built a better house. You can't just take certain components of high performance building and apply them to a building and say this is high performance. It's all cohesive. When you hit a wall, think about how you can go around it, through it, over it, under it. It's really critical that first project, find an architect, find a designer, find a structural engineer, an envelope engineer, even your plumber. Secret Sauce is, is working with your team to develop a system that day in, day out creates those predictable outcomes in exactly the same way. Brian McCauley always called it the tsunami. You get those early adopters and then the tidal wave and then the late adopters. In this master class. In this master class. In this master class, we're going to talk about what it takes to get to net zero. How do you build high performance? What are some of the things that you consider when you're getting into that high performance space. You might be interested in watching this master class if you want to learn my story of all the things I've screwed up in the last 20 years as a high performance home builder. It really gets into risk, change management, and how all of us as builders can embrace the change that's, that's most likely coming. And some of the things that you need to know to understand where the building code is going and how you're going to meet those new expectations.